given the graph below, solve f of x greater than g of x for f of x graphed here in blue and g of x graphed here in red. To solve this graphically, the solution to f of x greater than g of x is a set of x values where the graph of f of x is above the graph of g of x. Looking at the graph, let's first determine the x value where f of x equals g of x by determining the point of intersection. So the two lines intersect at this point here, and notice how the x value x coordinate at this point is negative 2, which means f of x equals g of x when x equals negative 2, but we're trying to solve f of x greater than g of x, so now we need to determine where the graph of f of x, the blue line, is above the graph of g of x, the red line. We'll notice to the left of negative 2, the graph of f of x is above the graph of g of x, so all the x values to the left of negative 2 are solutions to the given inequality. So if we graph this interval on the x-axis, we do not include negative 2 because that's where they're equal, and the inequality symbol is greater than, not greater than or equal to, so we'd have an open point on negative 2, then an arrow to the left. So this is the graph of our solution, but we're asked to express the solution using inequalities. So this interval would be x less than negative 2. But let's also express this interval using interval notation. As we move left from the number line, we approach negative infinity, and therefore, using interval notation, this interval would be from negative infinity to negative 2, and because negative 2 is not in the interval, we use a minor parenthesis here, as well as to the left of negative infinity. So these are the same intervals, but for this question, we're only asked to enter the solution as an inequality. I hope you found this helpful.